welcome to Saturday Dice Footy. I accidentally got sent Hamish McLaughlin's wardrobe, so I'm wearing a combo a little fruitier than I'd normally get into, but it does match the excitement I have for this game. Adelaide have decided to blood some new talent. First ever game of Telstra ADFL. Young Fisher Mackesy has a task of taking on David Mundy from Fremantle today. Mackesy tested very well at dice rolling uh, during the draft combine earlier, so it makes sense that he's selected. Can't wait to see where this one goes. It's Adelaide versus Fremantle to kick off Saturday Dice Football for Telstra, Australia's best mobile network. We've been really lucky with the access to players before the game, and I think we're going to cross to Adelaide now where uh, the youngster, Fisher, standing by, just 19 years of age. Are you there, Fish? Yeah, Andy here. Uh, thanks very much for taking the time. Obviously, nerves to be kicking in first ADFL match. Yeah, I'm pretty nervous. Obviously, experience isn't on my side. It's about one game to 300 odd games, so a little bit nervous, but hopefully my youthful exuberance could get me through for this Dice World game. You certainly seem exuberant at the moment. <laughs> well done, buddy. Uh, we'll cross across to Fremantle, where the champion, David Mundy, is sitting by. Uh, are you there, David? I am, Andy. Thanks for having me, Mars. Pleasure. Um, coming up against the younger operator today, do you worry whether you'll have the stamina to roll out the full four quarters? Oh, look, it's taken me a few more years to get to this dice game than it has Fisher, but uh, I'm confident that my experience will see me through. Oh, there's the warning siren. So I guess we'll get the two captains together to toss the coin. Uh, Jai, Fremantle fan, is standing by to toss the coin. Are you there, Jai? Yes, I am. Do you have a message for David Mundy, the Fremantle champ? Yeah, um, I was just hoping that he's going to play soon and um, see how his leg's going. Okay, David? G'day, Joe. Yeah, my leg's going really well, mate. I'm uh, fully fit and ready to go once the season resumes. So thanks for the question, mate. That's good. Hard-hitting questions, and that's what Jai is known for. You can catch his column this week in the Western Australian. Jai, you've got the, the coin ready to toss. Well, uh, Mackesy, you can call. Uh, toss away there, Jai. Tails. Tails is hey. the call. Heads it is. It's an early victory for Fremantle. Uh, Mundy, what are you going to do? Are you going to roll first or will you send the youngster in? Uh, we'll roll first. We'll set the score. Thank you. Fantastic. We'll let both guys get prepared. Thank you very much, Jai. This yeah. is bound to be an epic battle. It's age and wisdom versus youth and exuberance. Adelaide versus Fremantle. The veteran has possession of the dice as Mundy comes in to have his first roll. Oh, a 5-1. Straight kicking. And they're off to a fly. We thought they might get the jump. Over to Adelaide now. Mackesy with his dice in hand. You can see his heart pumping through his shirt. Off he goes. A 2-3 for Adelaide. Takes him to 15 points there. Just half the score of the fast-starting Fremantle Dockers. 5-1-31 plays 2-3-15 as we head into quarter time. 16 points, the difference. Adelaide have possession of the dice now. It seems like the youngster has calmed himself. Fish, off you go. 1-1. One, one. <laughs> <laughs> Welcome to the big leagues, buddy. <laughs> go on. 1-1, one, one, 22, still trailing Fremantle as Mundy now takes possession of the dice. He's got him on a string over there. 2-4. Oh, probably could have taken more advantage. There's a lot of forward entries there, just not straight kicking. 7-5, uh, 47, Fremantle Dockers lead. 3-4, 22, the Adelaide Crows as we head into the halftime break. It seems like a baptism by fire for the young draftee. If we can just have a little listen in. Yeah, no worries, Nixie, yeah. Yeah, I'm sick on him, yeah. Yeah, I'll be tougher, yeah. Yeah, welcome to the top level as we see the veteran Mundy just checking Instagram. A few direct messages saying, you got this, he knows. Uh, hope it doesn't come back to bite him as we head into what will be an interesting second half. 25 points the distance in favour of Fremantle as Mundy takes possession of the dice again. He would be trying to put his, obviously, the foot down and momentum keep going. You're not going to lay up, are you, David? 
Uh, premiership quarter coming out, third quarter. Okay, okay here we go. Ooh. 5G and two, it's good kicking. He moves on to 12 7 79, and we need a big quarter from your fish. Yeah, look, I got jumped early, but hopefully I can redeem myself here. I believe you can. Good luck, buddy. 6 1. <laughs> <It's> a, <laughs> here we go. 9 5 59, 12 set place, 12 7 79. It's a 20 point advantage. Fremantle, a chance for Adelaide to come back over the top in a huge quarter. I think Fremantle were praying for the siren as they can collect their thoughts right now. We might be able to get back down to uh, Fisher. What did the coach say uh, at that three-quarter time break, my friend? Oh, look, we've had we've had a very very bad first half, and then the third quarter we damned ourselves. Then, so I think it's just continue that continue that on. The nerves are all gone now, so I think it's just go go go. Yeah, Take, we, you know. Getting his hands on the dice a hell of a lot as we head yep. into this final quarter. As I mentioned, 20 points the difference. Adelaide have the first roll to see if they can hit the lead. Good luck. 1-6. Oh, no. 71 plays 79. Mundy, it's going to be tough to lose from here. <laughs> You've got the eight-point lead. Percentage is always important. Off you go, buddy. 5 was it 5-1? Five, 5-2. Five, two. Five, two, a 40 point win to Fremantle. 17-9 111 plays 10-11 71. We always knew that could happen when you're playing young talent, but boy did we see enough from him. It's going to be an exciting young player for us to keep an eye on throughout the season and future seasons for the ADFL. Monday, the Fremantle song is echoing around the park. What do you want to say to fans? Oh, thank you for getting behind me. What a great inaugural dice game. Uh, thank you for Fish. Thank you, Andy, for hosting us. And uh, what a great concept. Thank you very much. Oh, well said from the, uh, the veteran there. Uh, until the next game, I'm Andy Lee. See you next time.